In the course of 10 days, I lost Bethany first to death, which is worse than the other ones because um, it's so absolute. Um, and then I lost all my friends. They like went from being really supportive to gone. And um, I lost the church that I was a part of, people I trusted in, in leadership. They were gone. I would describe myself now as someone who still loves God, um, someone who still thinks God is in a relationship with God is so worthwhile. I literally wouldn't be alive right now if it wasn't for my relationship with God. Um, it's the only one who didn't bail when everybody else did. But I also am someone who doesn't, who sees in the world a lot more complexly than I did before. Um, I think absolutes are a lot more dangerous than I used to. And I have a really different idea of how to go about being a part of transformation for other people. It just looks really differently. Um, it's a lot more them-led, them-directed, instead of Tyler Deaton charisma-led, or like Tyler Deaton, you know, insight-directed, or something stupid like that. I mean, the last two years have been really, really painful. One of my authors I loved reading in the last two years said, really devastating loss is going to change you one way or the other. It's just you deciding how are you going to get changed. And I like to think that it's made me a more empathetic and understanding person.